Well, hello! Fancy meeting you here. For the holidays, because we're doing our very first holiday themed unboxing! Hallelujah. Mortimer, you're looking quite festive. So, our UV machine, Mortimer, will go ahead and help us cure everything. What do we have under the Christmas tree? Well, 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 it's a mini verse, make it mini holiday series two. Look at that, we get a tiny little Christmas tree. I want a tiny Christmas tree. All right, over here, it gives us a little bit of an idea of what we're gonna get. I think we're getting something Christmas tree themed. Oh, I think I know. Ooh. It's a gold ball. Pretty. Oh. Here's our little table. So cute. We've got plaid. Here's the base. Let's take a look at this bag first. Ah, we've got fruit. And look at this. We've got something wrapped in foil. Here's our tongs. And a little decoration. This looks like holly a knife and we've got a little honey dipper oh this is the top of our ball i didn't realize that that is so cute so for halloween all the seasons we have different little toppers for our balls these are so adorable and perfect for display i just noticed it has a little hole over here for you to put a string on it and turn it into an ornament that is too cute we get to hang these on our tree and over here we have crackers it is a charcuterie board we have everything that goes on one Aw, look at the little crackers and the little crusty bread. What's this? Makey, makey. <gasps> Happy Sun Farms. That's adorable. Makey, makey. Eggs and bakey. We have honey here. And here it is, our charcuterie board. Aw, here's our meats. Looks like we're getting some prosciutto. All right, guys, you ready to make this? First step up is getting some honey on our charcuterie board. That'll do. Then we'll move on to our cheese. Okay, so that didn't work. We are going to take our meat and put it in last when there's no room for anything else to move. So let's do the crackers. And we'll add these ones. So the meat you wanna add last. The instructions doesn't say that, but I think it'll work if we add the meat last and the rolls won't open. That's it, I'm going to super glue it. Operation Stubborn Meat in session. I'm gonna add some nail glue right here and then roll it up carefully so I don't get any of the glue on my hands. And then I'm gonna glue this part too. And hold it together until it dries. And Viola, meat that behaves. Now we can get it on our board with no problems. Take that, meat, haha. <laughs> They look like little meat flowers. All right, Mortimer, do your thing. While Mortimer's cooking that, let's go ahead and go for our next one. We have little gingerbread. We must be making the gingerbread log. Let's get everything out and set everything up. Roll cake, mocha, yummy. And let's check out our other things. What's this? It says chocolate hazelnut spread. So like Nutella. Powdered sugar, ooh. This must be our cake stand. Ooh, yep, it's our cake stand and some other things. We have doilies. Let's place one right here. And then we've got some berries and I guess mistletoe and some mushrooms. Here's our gingerbread cookies. And this is just our regular schmegler tongs and our little topper and a spatula. The Christmas tree wasn't the ultra rare, it's actually National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation Moose Mugs. All right, so this is a Yule log.
All right, so that was fun. Let's grab this one that is hiding behind the tree. Yay! Are we making a tree? Ooh, this one's gift wrapped. We've got a little stringy flangy. Here goes our tree parts. I wonder if it smells like pine. Nope, just plastic. Ooh, what is this part? Here's the other part. So are we supposed to put these together yet? No, not yet. What's this? Oh, this feels like something already leaked in there. Uh-oh, our resin popped open. Oh no. So what was this? Flock adhesive. And look, another little gift box. It's a tree topper. It's our Christmas star. Oh, something leaked in here too. Oh, it's from the other bag. So we've got a little bit of a mess in this bag, but that's okay. Is this where our tree goes? I think this is what we need to do. It's all coming together. And is this part the top part? Yup. Now we've got a tree. We just need to kind of floof up its branches a little bit. In this bag, we have our ornaments. And this must be our flocking. And here's our bag of stuffs. Ooh, we've got a little fancy schmancy brush here. If ever you guys' ball is like mine where it has a busted resin bottle inside, of course, wash your hands if it gets on you. And also, alcohol wipes helps because alcohol gets rid of the stickiness. Before we put our tree in here, we were supposed to put some of that resin on the bottom here so our tree doesn't come apart. Now we'll get that back on there. Now with our little brush, we're gonna get the resin all over the branches because this is our flocking adhesive, remember? Now we'll add the flocking. Let's first put our tree inside of our ball just so we can kind of sort of keep it clean. It's snowing. All right, I think that's good enough. That looks so nice. It looks like it freshly snowed on its branches. Now we have to cure this. At this point, we get to decorate. Now it doesn't say to put any resin for the star topper. And now for our cute little ornaments. These are so cute and tiny. I'm actually gonna use my tweezers because they're so, so tiny to get them on the tree. Oh, <gasps> I dropped one because the mini verse tongs are a little bit on the thick side, but I'm trying to get them on here and it's not working. All right, let's try this again. Here, oh, there you go. There's the little ornament. Let's get those on there that way. Some of the branches don't want to cooperate. You just have to find the ones that will. The branches are super thick, so they are not gonna fit the ornaments easy. You kind of have to push the branches into the ornament because they're so thick. Let's see if we can put one up here. Is this a thin one? This kind of looks like a thin one. Okay, we got that on there. And we're done. Here's our little Christmas tree. Let's actually remove it from here so you can see it in all of its tiny glory. Next one up, looks like it's another Christmas tree. But is there a secret to getting the ultra rare? Maybe it has a Christmas tree on top, but inside is actually the mugs. You never know. <laughs> looks like we're making a tree again. All right, we'll just wait for this one for another time. Let's try this one. This one says it's a charcuterie board. Right up here, we can see the little drawing. Okay, so I looked up online and it says the ultra rare can come in any of the little drawings, but it will have a green capsule instead of a gold capsule. It's a gold capsule. So we're getting the charcuterie board again. Now here's our last ball and our last chance to see oh, if we've got the green. Nope, it's a gold ball. So we're making another Christmas tree. But that's okay, we've got 
two out of actually three out of the four that you can get. We're only missing the ultra rare. I hope you guys have a beautiful day filled with sunshine and rainbows and I will see you later. Bye for now.